deadline day signing. It was quite late. It's the first chance I've had to catch up. Just talk us through uh, how that day played out for you. Yeah, it was. Um, it all happened quite quickly, actually. I only <clears throat> sort of found out that previous night, really, um, of any interest. So um, it all happened quite quickly for myself. Um, you know, but 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 I'm glad I'm here now. How did they sell the club to you? Clearly, it's football league again. Yeah, you know, it's. it's as he said, it's football league. It's it's full time, which is what I always wanted to come back into. Um, and you know, Swindon's a, a massive club with with a lot of history. So um, you know, it was a it was a no brainer in the end. How was it at Bamberg? Has he scored quite a few from a, from a winger's position? Yeah, it was um, you know an enjoyable time for me. Left um, left full time football and and went straight there to you know to to play regularly and. Was there for about a year and a half in the end, and you know, just just enjoying being out on the pitch and, and doing what I love doing. Time to talk out of this weekend's game. How was it for you at Northampton? What memories do you have there? Yeah, it was good. You know, I've, I made a lot of memories there. Made, you know, made my debut, football league debut. Made my got my first first contract at you know a, a professional club. So you know, I've, I respect them in you know in, in that way with for what they've given me um, and you know I'm, I'm excited to, to see some familiar faces um, but it should be a should be a good test for us as you know they're, they're, they're flying at the minute. Were they all about set pieces when, when you were there as well? Um, Which was a bit more yeah, the, that. There's been a change in obviously management from from when I was there. Um, they had a few when I was there and you know they've, they've just got them, them personnel in that Know are, are a threat from set pieces, and yeah, they seem to be seem to be doing all right with them so far. And then when you came into the Swindon Town dressing room, were there familiar faces around here or not? Uh, there was a few, yeah, there was a few to be fair. Um, but you know, it's just like any other dressing room. You you know, you need to adapt, and you know, I've, I feel like I've I've settled in quickly, and you know, I'm, I'm enjoying my time here already. Would you have Johnny Williams, Luke Jeffcott from the Wales set up as well? No, they. They, um, I think Jeffy, I think might be slightly older than me. Um, but no, Johnny was. I was only 21 when, obviously Johnny was was probably away with the first team. Um, you know, but you know they're they're two, you know, big names in in the Wales football. And um, yeah, so I knew of them. And but yeah, as I said, I've, I've settled in nicely, and and the lads are the lads are great. And the gaffer just said Johnny's had his week away because he never actually got to play. Yeah. <laughs> Big year for Wales. Yeah, massive. Obviously, World Cup. Um, you know, we're really excited to, you know, to to see what happens with them. And you know, good luck to Johnny if he ends up going. We've obviously seen you in the trophy and as a sub in the league. Are you looking forward to starting in the league. Yeah, of course. You know, that's you know a big thing. While you know, while I wanted to come back to full time football to to play in the football league, and um, you know, I'm, I'm ready when when the chance comes. Wish you luck, Morgan. Thank you very much. Thank you.